bikes, well, they've got smaller. So today you can buy a 1,000cc bike that's the size of a 250 from just a few years ago. But there are small bikes and there are small bikes. I'm talking like this big. You'd think, wouldn't you, that as it's a form of miniaturised motorcycling, that Mini Moto originated in Japan, the home of all things tiny. But it actually came from Italy, where it was seen as the first step on the rung towards a motorcycling career. I think that Valentino Rossi actually took his first tentative winning steps on a Mini Moto. And if I was 10, I suppose I could see the appeal. However, as you'll have no doubt noticed, it's hard for a full-grown man not to look ridiculous on a Mini Moto. I have only ever ridden one once. I got it up to top speed and it promptly threw the chain, which wrapped itself around a rear wheel spindle. I left the longest, thinnest skid mark in history and I've never ridden one since.